Welcome to a drizzle-filled day in the hammer as the 0-3 Tiger Cats aim to break their win column goose egg against Ottawa. Schultz in the gun on second and eight. Looks to his left, comes back right over the middle. It is complete. And they'll move the chains on second and seven plus. Hamilton, the second worst team in the CFL in doing so, but opening up with a great connection here. This one just a ship shot. 13 yards away. Hammers it through into the Stickley Bar. It happens to be right here in Hamilton. So many connection points for Masoli and his family as he zips this one underneath, completes his first pass of 2023, and it will move the chains for the Red Blacks. Get hit in game uniform. Well, check that one off. Looks out to his right this time, zips it. Incomplete intended for Tuggle as Chris Edwards was there in coverage, and it'll be the punting unit coming out for Ottawa. Battling it out in the East Division. Schultz moves McAllister last second across the formation. Now 18 steps up, he'll go down the pass rush. Once again gets home for the Ottawa Red Blacks. Best sack percentage against dropbacks in the CFL. They had 12% of opponent dropbacks being brought to the turf coming into this one. At their 13th special teams penalty of the year. Now the kick comes from 50 away. The distance, never an issue. The accuracy, not in question either. Ottawa second and eight. Pressure on. Masoli hit by Thurman, fades it up, and it is intercepted. Chris Edwards down the right sideline. And he'll get pushed out of bounds at the 30, but Hamilton with a 6-0 lead. And an early turnover here in the second quarter. And Schultz this time will throw it into the back of the end zone, up for grabs, and... Did Sindani hold on to it? Coleman there in coverage, they'll say, incomplete. After review, the ruling on the field stands. It'll be, it's an incomplete pass, it'll be third down, Hamilton has charged a timeout. On second and ten, Masoli, and he goes down. Oh. Stumbles back to his feet, and Jeremiah doesn't look right. Well, you saw him grab that left knee right away when he went down. And you see... This is how players feel about Jeremiah Masoli as players from both teams immediately offering their concern and support. A little bit of maction in the Canadian Football League. Improving over and over again. He'll get to throw here, or will he? Pressure's on, and Crum is down. Coaches that, that spent the time with him and, and helped develop him and called plays for him, etc. Teammates. As Crum goes for a run through the middle, showing off the wheels. In replacement of Jeremiah Masoli on first and ten, rolling towards a minute remaining in the opening half. During his college career at Kent State, he shows it there. See if he goes again, sees an opening. Crumb to the five, touchdown Red Blacks. Welcome to the CFL, Dustin Crumb. Yeah, as much as Dustin Crumb may not have been ready for the Hamilton Tiger Cats defense, I'm not sure the Hamilton Tiger Cats defense is ready for Dustin Crumb. those legs sets him up to run it in for the touchdown Justin Hardy catches the slant over the middle he would have caught that clean he would have been him one-on-one -on -one against Chris Edwards with only the end zone just guiding the helmet <laughs> towards where the football was going maybe that's why Schiltz stands in strong throws it over the middle it was an intercepted, a flag is down in the offensive backfield. But Ty Cranston comes up with the interception for well, they, now. They, they, Washington runs a complex system. That's protection here for Crown. He takes a shot over the middle, up in the air. Simone Lawrence has got it. Hamilton gets the interception back. Who actually exchanged their vows just nine days ago in front of the sculpture afterwards? Well, let's let him run this out, guys. Lots of celebrated Hamilton. Tyreek McAllister, touchdown Hamilton. 64 yards. Washington dials up here, defensive coordinator. It's pressure. Crum has it all over him. Ball is out. It's loose on the turf. Rolling around. Hamilton 
trying to get on it. It's Big Teddy Laurent. Back-to-back turnovers created by the Hamilton Tiger Cats. They're veterans coming through. First Simone Lawrence, now it's the big fella, Ted Laurent. Who makes it to the stadium across the CFL. A great night for football here in Hamilton. Rain earlier has dissipated and right through the middle. It goes McAllister. He was close to getting into the end zone for the second time tonight. Leaving the door open here with 10.50 remaining in the fourth quarter. So many changes even from the start of June. Crom with the pressure on. Man coverage throws an interception. Picked off by Richard Leonard. He missed one earlier. He gets this one right into his chest. Eyes went right. Godwin is right down the middle. Might have been a major, but it results in three more. Five options for Crom. Pressure on. Justin Crum would love to get a win here in his first action in the Canadian Football League. Takes off running, makes a man miss across midfield. Crum stays on his feet all the way down to the 48-yard line. And Ottawa's in business with 48 seconds remaining. Late substitutions from Hamilton. Crum's going to take off and run. Can he find the end zone? chance Dustin Crum gave them two yards away from a potentially game-tying score.